can we? Okay, yeah, my hand can't. Literally the other. Okay, I don't, I don't know what it wants me to do now. I haven't gone this way yet, so maybe... Ooh! This shit, right? Oh, God damn it. All right, well, we're going to need a permanent solution to this problem we got. the shot Kablamo. oh that didn't actually you can't even re oh my god I was gonna end up slowly killing me if I don't Let me guess, you can't fucking do- Whoa, whoa, whoa the camera's freaking out, whoa. You can't even fucking- oh my god. This is just gonna end up killing me. Okay, we can go through that now.
looks like some sort of surgery room where they make these bodies. I don't think I'm gonna have enough time. We can try that, I guess. To like get rid of this and then go over here. Okay, that's like super short now, okay. There has to be something to do with this. I mean, it just doesn't let me go out. You have to... Let's see. So we got that. Perform surgery on myself. Okay. Uh, well, I think it's gonna definitely become a problem. Damn it, 
escaped. Oh, it doesn't look like we're doing too good. Shit's all busted. Oh, only one way to go. Yeah, you can do it. You just gotta believe. Though again, I don't even know what the hell it is you're trying to do. Guess we're probably gonna find out exactly what this guy wants, or something's gonna happen. You can see these guys there, the brains just coming out. Does it want from us? Do we do we go on that thing? Is this a good thing? Maybe we can interact with this. I guess we should. I don't understand this room, but hey, we're dying, so why not?
Oh, just scooping up our innards, it seems. <laughs> just throw them back up. That's garbage. Don't need that anymore. Well, it seems to have thrown my brain up there. Oh, I can see into the future. Okay. I appear to be one of those motors now. What's, uh, what's happening? Looking just does that. Oh, okay, it's weird. H I J K L O P M N. Okay, that's just doing that randomly. Oh, space bar. So, okay. So, we hit space bar to switch between these things. So let's see what the hell that even did. Yeah, it's just like poking in my organs. Uh, oh yeah, we got these like little things on our back. Oh, it's got like a skull face in the back. That's kind of cool. Okay, well I guess we're just gonna move this guy this way. Can we? See, these bodies don't seem to feel pain. Let's get this guy. Is there a reason that we're doing this? Is okay. Well, let's just. On that, then use this. For what purpose is this horrid thing? Okay. I think it needs to stay on that. Oh. It's 
go into cutscene mode. Okay, I can't actually move, but I can hit W to go forward. We're going to a place. We're going to a thing. There's like these things here pointing. Bring our body. We don't actually have a mouth, so we never could actually speak. So that's, that's a thing. Bringing it to the to the void wall. Still don't know if this is a good thing, but we're inching closer. Okay. We're here. Oh. We're transcending again or something. I don't know what's going on. Oh, uh oh. No! Okay, our character really wants to go over there. No! Something tells me we failed in our mission. So close to the line. Ugh. Okay, now the door's locked behind us. Does that change the ending at all?
seem to. Yep, this thing's still max on us. No, nope, it just seems like it's, uh, the thing's not helping us. That's just how it goes. Okay. Okay, well, we're just gonna go back to the main menu. Well, that was Scorn, I guess. Uh, yeah. What can I say about it? It's definitely an experience. Uh, it's obviously gross and horrifying. Um, I would definitely suggest getting this on the Game Pass. For what it is, it's an interesting thing, but it's not worth the price that it is. I think it's like 50 something dollars. Canadian, uh, sorry to say, like, it's definitely, like, a cool game and everything, and it's got interesting things, but, like, what the, whatever, um, yeah, so if you have Game Pass, like, uh, and you think this is, uh, something interesting, something neat, uh, and you want to try it for yourself, I would suggest getting in on that, other than that, I can't really say that I would recommend this, paying full price for this at all. Definitely quite a disturbing experience. And a lot of it is, uh, again, an implied narrative that you really gotta piece together yourself and kind of come to your own conclusions with a lot of stuff. Uh, my whole, I guess you can say, theory of what was going on there is like, I guess this is the culmination of some sort of weird bio-organic, technologically like inclined people that ultimately their main goal was to make some sort of shared super-consciousness. At the end, end there, and that's where I think all the brains are up on the thing, and the only way to do that is to, you know, connect yourself like that, and do this whole process, and then fling yourself into whatever hole that was, and then you become a part of this great super consciousness. Which, I guess, would be like, us performing the true singularity with machines, have you ever seen that theory? When we would become, like, uploaded uh, consciousness, I guess, but in an organic way, so... That's what I think, but I'm not sure. I have no idea at the end of the day what the fuck I just really witnessed. But, uh, yeah. That was the game. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this playthrough. Um. Again, I'm back from doing, like, a lot of stuff, and so I'll probably be doing more gameplay videos and uploading more stuff. Uh, and look forward to, uh, Plague Tale. The Requiem, which is a sequel to Plague Tale Innocence, uh, which is a really fun game, so I'm going to probably be playing that after this and uploading that, but uh, thanks again, and I'll see you later.